They were joined by Minister Patrick O'Donovan in Kilmallock this Wednesday morning. Patrick, there's been some severe flooding here uh, both on Monday night and of Monday night of last week. What are the issues and, and, and looking to the future, what can be done? Well, first of all, um, I'm here with the council staff and uh, staff from the Office of Public Works in my role as Minister for the Office of Public Works here on the Luba uh, in the middle of Kilmallock. And basically, um, on the, the nights in question, we got massive rainfall. Um, record event um, here in the catchment area of the Luba, which resulted in the river um, spilling out, uh, unfortunately causing damage not only here in the town, uh, but in adjoining um, townlands as well outside the area. So I've had the officials of the OPW here. I know the Limerick County Council have already done works here uh, to try and I suppose clean up some of the damage that has been done and support the residents. Uh, now what I'm, um, I suppose, looking to see what we can do is in relation to the river itself, uh, what the Office of Public Works can do in the short term uh, with the council and then maybe as well looking at a longer term project uh, in terms of the maintenance and management of the river. So um, I understand the uh, difficulties that this has caused you know it's an awful thing to have water coming into your property especially uh, you know if it hasn't flooded before and there isn't a history of flooding and as well as that for people who have flooded before it's terrible to have water coming into their properties again so look it's my responsibility on behalf of the government to try and address it with the local authority and I want to thank the staff of Limerick City and County Council and the local fire services and, and everybody really neighbours and everybody else who has helped uh, people that have been affected not only here in Kilmallock but all across Munster in the last couple of days where we've seen unprecedented rainfall uh, and I'm going to work with the council and my own officials in OPW here now to see if we can put a plan in place for Kilmallock.